I've got to get rid of this pen. The Veterans Stadium is right here. This is the Spectrum. Been here since the 60s. Here is the Wachovia Center where the Flyers play. And the 76ers as well as Brad Johnson throws and hits Warren Sapp as they put Sapp into the backfield or into the offensive formation on the end of the line and he takes it to the 11-yard line to move the chains in a first down. Look at all those players. The defensive players love it. Even the offensive players love it. Yeah, was just getting set up. He's a tight end, and we've seen it all night where they've been putting him in in short yardage. And if you watch Warren Sapp in practice, you know, you think he's a big old slug defensive tackle. This guy is a great athlete. <laughs> John Lynch, do, I mean, he, he probably knew the call was in there. Sapp had probably been talking all week. Hey, coach, I can catch. I can catch as well as any of them. McFarland and Warren Sapp are in offensively with a first and goal from the six. Yeah, we know about Warren Sapp getting in, in short yardage situations. That started last year, but to my knowledge, this is the first time that Anthony McFarland has joined him in the, in the lineup. Everything screams run. We'll see if they pass, and they do, and it's Sapp. You think he loves it? Warren Sapp for the touchdown. <laughs> and, and the pogo stick. I mean, is that all he's got? <laughs> <laughs> he had to have known all week they were going to run this play when they got down there in that situation, and that's all he's got? Well, I'm with you. That was tired. <laughs> i tell you what, though. What an athlete. What an athlete for a defensive tackle to be able to come out on a pass route. You're going to see him right here, Warren Sapp, 99, and then catch the ball. And that's pretty nice. <laughs> <laughs> He didn't want to get hit by Corey Hall after making the catch, so he made a move even in the end zone. And it's now 17 to 3, Tampa Bay on top here in Atlanta, with a minute 55 remaining. Now he's in the tight end position, but I don't know how you lose Warren Sapp. Well, Brady Smith is the one who gets his hands on him. I, I, I can't fault Brady Smith for not. <laughs> how could you not guys not like that? That's a classic. <laughs> Going for it on fourth and one, and they roll out, tossing it to Sapp of all people oh for a first down. Gosh. Brad Johnson had a ton of room to run to pick up the first down, and instead he lobs it to Sapp. Warren Sapp covered up. <laughs> I mean, he's wide open. Look at, there's nobody. Look at the vertical. That's 300 plus pounds. Oh, he got that up. gets lost in the shuffle. He got How up. does that happen? His second touchdown of the year. 